What's going on guys? Beastly Gamer here. Welcome to the channel. For people out there on the PlayStation side who happen to be audiophiles who like nice headphones like Astro's, Sony Gold Headset, Turtle Beach headphones, if you enjoy nice sounding headphones with your PlayStation experience, then Sony's got some exciting news for you. I'll drop a link in the description. Sony's new high-end wireless PS4 headset coming on January 17th. Sony has unveiled the PlayStation wireless headset aimed at PS4, PSVR, and mobile users. The model has hidden noise-canceling microphones and, like the gold model, supports 7.1 virtual surround sound. However, it's also equipped with the 3D audio tech used on the PlayStation VR, meaning you'll be able to get the same surround sound effects from a regular PlayStation 4 console. Though no PS4 games currently support 3D audio, Naughty Dog will release a patch that brings it to Uncharted 4 at these end. A couple of other games will also support the 3D audio tech later on. MLB The Show 17, Uncharted The Lost Legacy, and Days Gone, with more to be announced later. In a similar way to systems from Dolby and others, it quote, simulates the effect of audio arriving at your ears from different directions and distances to mimic the behavior of sound in real life, end quote, according to the PlayStation blog. The wireless part only works on the PS4 via a wireless adapter. For the PlayStation VR and mobile, you'll need to use the included 3.5 millimeter audio cable. However, Sony has noted before that 3D audio only works on wireless headphones for VR and has confirmed that it won't work in wireless mode on the PS4 either. So for regular PS4 games, you can go wireless, but to get the 3D audio, you'll have to plug it in, which frankly is kind of stupid. For titles that don't support 3D audio, Sony said in its comment section of the post that the headset, quote, has an enhanced version of 7.1 virtual surround sound. So even in games without 3D audio, the Platinum Wireless headset will have a better virtual surround sound, end quote. However, the fact that Sony uses its own proprietary 3D audio makes choosing a sound system a bit awkward. The Xbox One, for example, will soon support Dolby Atmos surround sound. And while that'll only work for Blu-ray playback, at least you can run the audio through the Dolby Atmos receiver to get the full effect. So if you'd rather blast games through your home theater system rather than a headset, Said, it doesn't appear that you'll get the full 3D effect. So it seems there are some serious pros and cons with this headset. If you'd like to buy a headset that simulates virtual 3D audio, this will work, but it only works with PlayStation VR and only when it's plugged in. Uh, in this article, I don't see anything about price. Right now I'm using the Sony Gold headset, the Uncharted 4 A Thief's End version, and I'm really enjoying those. It works really, really well. It has noise canceling and it sounds great to me. Uh, I have experienced the 3D audio on my PlayStation VR. It's really amazing. I don't know if this is worth picking up just for that, but for the guys out there who are interested in Sony proprietary hardware that happens to look really nice and sleek, while also adding some pretty unique features like virtual 3D audio, this PlayStation's Platinum Wireless headset really isn't a bad decision. You can go wireless while using your PS4, but in order to get that virtual 3D audio, it'll have to be corded with the 3.5 millimeter jack. You guys let me know what you think in the comments below. Is this something that you might be looking forward to in the future with PlayStation, or do you have a favorite headset out there? I know a lot of people are really big into the Astro, something I've never tried. I've had a few Turtle Beaches, and right now I'm kind of sticking with my Sony Gold, which has not let me down, it has great sound, great noise cancellation, and for the most part, it's given me a lot of bang for my buck. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you did, give a thumbs up and show support for the channel. Join the Facebook group, follow me on Twitter, and you can support the channel at BeastlyGamer.com. I'm the Beastly Gamer, and I'll see you guys next time. Hey,